Hey guys, I'm Tekax. Hit the subscribe button. Let's start. Today, we're going to be doing Infinity RPG Oculation Update Guide Part 4. So last off, we ended the Glass World in Solaris. Loading. So you want to use the Exoplate Armor Module 2 for weapon. You should have the NG Sword from the boss. Of course we're gonna use Speed Potion just to uh, go faster. Because see how slow that is. We're gonna use uh, Model 1s. Because... Uh, most people aren't gonna have MK2 by now, cause, you know, not only in levels yet. I need, like, past Ghost Valley just to even start unlocking it. Okay, so we're on to go to Everworld. Over here, some Shroom Shrinkers. Kill them. Drop 360 level. We have some stronger Shroom Skirmishers. Them down. Might take a few hits, but you'll get it. 750. But. And should they do drop it? Do they? Yeah, so they can drop the Shroom Slinger, the Mushroom Knight Armor. Don't need the Mushroom Knight Armor. Because Axel Plate will last up until you get the uh, Witch Armor. Yeah, the Gargantuan the Celestial Armor. As Exoplate has only 8 plus swap speed. And then Gargantuan will have 100 million more SP. Yeah. Okay. So, for the artifact, you want to go to this mushroom between these two skirmishers and climb up the Secret Tross. And over here, you have the fungus baby. So let's equip the assume slinger. Of course, it's easier to use melee because like it's harder to hit it in slow hitbox. But but he does drop 2,000 level. Okay, so in order to get an artifact, you have to kill the ancient shroom dragon, long mushroom valley over here kill him I think it might take like three minutes with the swim slingers go up here go for the artifact go to the same place up here and take the left to the wall then in this like odd, oddly colored part I have the sophisticated badger which gives 15k at levels it's pretty good for uh, that part Okay. Let's go to next world, fantasy world. Also have the breaker. Just use the dark pistol. These nightmares are bad robots and rampant bad bots and rampant robots will never end. And is this a gun? Yeah, that's all. The, that's the entire gimmick. Is is this a gun? Okay. I have some of these guys, Dodd Masons. Of course, your bullet level should be. Tink. Yeah. Got to verify. Okay, yeah, so you're only gonna have the high tech bullet as of now. Unless if you unlock the uh, Intel Monster. You know, Tell Monsters for different boss. Yeah. Okay, so you just gotta shoot them down. They aren't that hard. You just gotta keep shooting. Now, after you get a few thousand levels, 25k, and go over here to the Grand Aunt Mason, which is a shade. Sage. And then go around this way. And then you have Dark Automaton. Automaton. 
Now for the artifact, use Axoplate 2 armor. I'm guessing most of you are in the group, because I told you so. If you're not, then go join the fight now, because you kinda need it. This is pretty good. For this, like, near start Solvest part. And also at the beginning. Okay, so you want to go to... So yeah. Okay, so to the right of the red line, and to the left of the purple line, and you don't have to be like certain level, you can just skip uh, the walls. Just jump up here. You can also climb the truss if you don't have the armor. And then you have Magical Mystery Hat. And the uh, boss, Sades doesn't drop anything, but uh, Dark Automation drops the Orbit Strike, which is your second laser. You can just uh, melt these guys down. Yeah, let's go back now. But we'll unlock a boss. So go back. And then you have the epic duck. The epic duck. Then you have the stuck. Which you're gonna want to one from. It's gonna like just keep it like that. Oh, that sounds from the... Or just like... I haven't heard that before. Probably because I have my sound off. Just uh, kill that big duck. What you'll do is you'll get Duck Tower. There's a uh, Twang Weapon. Super boss, so it's gonna explode. But it is magic. So, let's go to the boss. Grip the ducks. Yeah, we equip it. There you go. See? Okay. Now, after you kill him, you don't have to, you can come back later. And go to Mythical uh, Rainbow Road. Here's the part where I uh, grind for like the start. So, what I did was I got supercharged Nova Hammer. Kill this guy. I'd stand here. Auto clicker, and then just put it like that. Then I would get like 600 levels each time. But I don't need it anymore. It's already, you know, max level. But, uh, could use Devil's Pittsburgh if you want. That won't come on until much later. Then you can grind in Ghost Valley using Pitchfork, so I'll need this area after that. So I'll just use Zonic Sticer, go to the Mushroom, then just stay in the corner and farm. And if you want the artifact, go to the second plate, then see this Crimson Honey Pad, jump down, and I died. Go back. Okay, so don't fall this time. Hurry back. Let's just speed up the process. Uh, back to where we were. Just gonna go over here. Yes, I'm using Capoir armor because that's the fastest one I have. Before I was using Astral Sender, but. Okay. Exo plate. Okay. Drop down, but don't fall off. There you go. Now, we have the Hooded Space Lord. Okay, let's go back. Okay. Now... Sorry, I had to, like, attack someone. Okay. So... Just have to go up. 
past these guys. Spectrum Slasher. And we have Spectrum Suitor, which gives you a 120. So it's like or two of these uh, slashers. So if you're better single target DPS and I use the shooters. If you have area attack, then use the slashers. And I have mythical rainbow god. Going, be so much faster. You see how fast I'm going. In fact, I think I'm outrunning him. Yeah. See that? Outrunning him. Can't catch me. Actually, it might be closing in because closer to the circle. Okay. Now we can kill him. Uh, should have rainbow wrap again, so unless if it's stopped by the boss, then yeah, I think it might drop, drop from the boss. No, it can drop from normal enemies. But you're also gonna have rainbow rounds now. So with your actual plate armor, you can tank a lot more hits. It's like walk like this. Keep your distance, but like not too far. Like, you can see I'm going down the chest P, so it'll probably take like a minute and a half, two minutes, yeah, two minutes probably. Ooh, breaker screen. Okay, person and breaker, might see me down the surface and like dual welding, but don't underestimate it. And the secondary weapon. Okay, yeah, it's not really that good, I mean, like, really, it's only for the burning effect. But, like, super weak. Okay, yeah, let's go back to his spawn. Still use the actual plate armor. Now for weapons. Yeah. Just use the rainbow wrap again, so. Go into portal room. Now, but this part, it's gonna be like super dark. So you want to use the glass lantern, see better. Yeah, see how dark is that? They kind of made like the death world a bit more scary until you go loopless and then look at the Rexodon Then just look Scoofy, the big dinosaur guy. So Glass Lantern. Of course you could just use this since it has a light. We have some of these Nifliums. I don't know why they look like that. Oh yeah, anomalies can also like ward off the other enemies somehow. It's like a barrier. All these guys. It's supposed to be like giant humans, but like nah, I don't think they really look like giant humans. They just kind of look giant. But uh, there's every there's a chance it can also spawn tormented carcass. There's a scarecrow looking dude. Kill him down it's kind of fast so yeah you can just keep them at this distance and then you're gonna have the hooded assassin it's this spooky guy right here with a gun that sucks at aiming apparently you can outrun a gun now so you can buy onyx dicers from the shop might take two Three minutes. No, four minutes. Not three minutes. Yeah. Take three minutes to kill him. But if you want the, but if you want the artifact, you want. Hey. Give me that. Okay. So you just want to walk around. You want to find like this kind of cliffy area. It's not like really a cliff, it's kind of more like just step up. You can just follow the left wall. Oh yeah, so... What the? What does that sound? Okay, so like, when everything's foggy, the Tormentor carcass spawns. Which is usually around that area. Oh, but when it clears up, you can see clearly. Let's come over here, climb up these rocks. And then up here, double jump. Here you go, decaying pumpkin head. It's kind of slower area. It's 
So then, should be on to the next world. After grinding a bit. But this time you want to use deep sea body armor. Okay. Now on go to Mediterranean Abyss. If you want the artifact, just 180, go to the wall, go to the right, and then at the corner, got this tiny area. Then you have the WC Ultimates Diamond Adapts. Go over here. Kill some of these Man of War 30. And then you have some Man of War Wojo. Okay, just want to walk through. Add a few bit more levels. Then you have the File Commander. If you kill him, then you have the Spistleware Whale. I don't know why, you, but not gonna lie. Kind of like creepy. You have this like red texture. You got this red lighting. Black. Then you have this giant whale. It just seems like it's like it gets closer and closer. I know because I don't have the speed potion on. Yeah, makes that like whale sound. It's just like creepy area. Oh, I don't know why I'd choose red. Like, make it blue at least. Walls are terrifying though. Let's quickly kill him. You also have vampire broadax, which like. Sold this from Transylvania, so you immediately lost it, and somehow ended up in Deep Invis. Good going, I guess. This kid did came from Transylvania, then like, this would kind of be LP. It's not like that good. But at level, but uh, 50k levels later, you can do Super Boss. It's kind of hard, so I just like use heals and Rainbow as if again, as Venja. And then you get the uh, tank, yeah, this one, wave tower, like this spas. You can see it's like laser. Deals some pretty high damage. So just a water gun. Still don't know why there's cat armor. Like apparently now there's secret cat boss, cat board boss. Kinda zesty if you ask me. Okay, I'll probably for the last one of this video, Great Northern Badlands. You have some free adventure armor. And this guy still smiling even though he's pinned to the pinned to a cross. It's popular to, oh, to wear popular, proper attire when venturing to Solaris. Plus, you don't want to get your sea armor dirty, do you? It's been to enough selfishness. Tiny pun. And you have some bighorn seeps. This is. If you get to this level, then you can finally get the supercharged Nova Hammer. You can use it, just do this. Slow them down. But you also could. Can't really use the Aquatic Claymore. Not really the Rose Quartz Claw. Usually just use Wave Tower. And just smelts them down easily. Just do that, and they're dead. So, I was seeing if I could like manage fit in climb terrain at your peril, stage of fear. At least the stage of uh, fear warns us. It's nice of him, even though he's gonna dominate us. At King of the Pack, finally suffered their fate after the fuck has been deleted depleted. Yeah, so if you want the next artifact. Let's just heal up. Wanna go to this wall? See that brick up there? You wanna jump, position camera, and click it. You just click as fast as you can, try to get between. There you go. Now, you have to do the obby, but instead of actually like doing the entire thing with that actual plate armor too, you can just double jump up here. You don't have to worry about the lava. And then you're over here. And you have the doll sign, doll sign, doll sign. And uh, you can collect it and you'll go back. 
since I'll collect it, I can't. So I'll go back all the way. Okay. Now we're back in Great Northern Badlands. Yeah, some of these, like, oh, realms, I don't really get it right over here. Like, we're just killing a bunch of, like, animals. Yeah, that's some like, Terracotta Warriors. Let's stop the Clear AO. Yeah, we could just buy it from Sop. Kill them. But then you also have big seep jockey, big orange seep jockey. Then you have one of these things. It's okay. I need a weapon that doesn't just kill him. Then. Okay, so you have leader of a northern pack. It's usually just runs away from you. Then you have the mage of the northern pack, the warrior, and the archer. So archer usually shoots bullets, uh, the leader just runs away. Don't know why all the leaders just run away, like Howard. Then you got the warrior, which just constantly chases you. And then you have uh, the mage, which uh, is just the same as archer, practically. But they do drop the nova arrow. And also the Nova Bow. I have it. Yeah. I can use this. Don't want to like go up. Kind of annoying. Guess it's decent. But I think uh, that's enough for part 4. I think this series might last 8 parts. Like, come on. Like, yeah, you're not gonna finish the game in uh, 10 minutes. This is real time, not like spat up footage. Now this other guy on YouTube, I think Chillman or something. I don't know, but uh, he has like every part going level by level. So if you want like a follow with him, do the same thing he does. You can watch him. But I'm here like if you want a quick uh, guy. Anyways, bye guys. Hope you liked the video. Hit the like subscribe button. Bye.